Welcome back children's I hope all you are well. In this video we are going to learn about movement in animals. So let us start. Without the ability to move there would be no life on earth. And the movement from one place to another place is called locomotion. Animals need to move from place to place in search of food to protect themselves from the enemies and to build resting and breeding places. There are animals that move on land, in the air and in the water. Each of these environments requires a different type of locomotion. So different animals have different mode of locomotion. Some animals fly, some animals walk and run, some animals swim and some animals crawl. So let us start with aquatic animals. Aquatic animals have special organs which help them to swim. Fishes have adapted to live in water. Fishes have fins to move in water. The fins help fish to swim and to maintain balance in water. The tail fin help them to change direction. When aquatic animals move through the water, they need to overcome a force so that they can move easily through water. This force is also called water resistance. So to overcome this force or water resistance, fishes have some structural adaptation like they have streamlined body, they have modified limbs and they have swim bladder. Fishes swim by moving their body and the tail area. Fins allow the fish to move and to keep balance and to turn. Fish keep their balance with pelvic and pectoral fin. The scale covered streamlined body is slimy which help them to swim faster and for moving up and down and for keeping to a particular depth fish use a gas filled swim bladder. So these are the adaptation of fish. Turtle and tortoise have paddle like limbs which push water and help in swimming. Observe a frog's movement on the ground. A frog support itself with its hind legs when it jumps. They have a number of movement to adaption with environment such as Climbing, jumping, walking, running and swimming. Frogs have webbed feet to swim and on land they use their long hind legs to jump. Penguins use their two forelimbs as a flippers to push water and to swim. Penguins may spend several months at a time at sea and only coming a seashore for breeding. Penguins are most comfortable and most graceful when moving in the water. Penguins have strong but short legs. Their big feet are webbed to help with swimming. The wings of penguins are more suited for swimming than flying. In fact, these wings look like flippers. Movement in insects. Insects have six legs which are used for movement. A grasshopper use its long hind legs for hopping. Many insects have one or two pair of wings which they use to fly in the air. Like all flies and mosquito, the house fly has one pair of wings. The house fly flies very quickly and can move its wings up to 33 times per second. Insects like lice, bugs, termites do not have wings. They move by crawling. Now movement in birds. Birds have wings which help them to fly. The wings are attached to the large breast muscle 
to make flying easier a bird has light hollow bones this reduces the bird's body weight and make flight easier birds use their hind legs for walking hopping and perching birds like emu ostrich and kiwi have wings but they cannot fly due to their large size and are called flightless birds now movement in reptiles reptiles have scales on their body and they move by crawling on the ground reptiles like crocodile chameleon and lizard have limbs and they move with their help reptiles like snake do not have limbs they have scales or plates on the underside of the body that are attached to the ribs the strong and flexible muscle of the snake contract and expand and this help it to move forward now movement in mammals mammals have four well developed limbs animals like cow camel dog etc use all their four limbs for walking and running human beings use only two limbs for walking and they are called hind limbs they use their hand or four limbs for holding or catching the things so in this video we learnt about the movement in animals in next video you will learn about the migration thank you